Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. So I really wanted to do a weekly vlog this week and do a last week of summer and show you guys what I'm doing and how I'm getting ready for school. But this week has really gotten away from me. I've been so crazy busy and I've also been filming a lot of other videos too. So the weekly vlog just didn't happen, but I really wanted to vlog today and this is going to be one of my last summer vlogs, which is crazy. Today is Thursday, August 22nd and I go back to school on Monday the 26th. So I only have a few days left and today is an example example of me squeezing in so many different things before I go back. I'll outline my day for you quickly. So this morning I have a meeting for one of the extracurriculars that I'm doing at my school this year. And then this afternoon I have a bunch of appointments. And then tonight I'm going out to dinner with my friends and we're going to the Glossier pop-up shop in Boston, which I'm so excited for. But I have a bunch of work and life stuff this morning and then I'm trying to squeeze in the social fun stuff tonight. But that is what my days have been like recently and it's really crazy. Starting off the morning, of course, with a coffee run got to get myself going but we'll see where this day takes us i just really wanted to vlog so i hope you guys enjoy hey, sorry about the air conditioning sound in the background it is so hot outside like just the small walk to starbucks i was like whoo but this is so good also i've been wearing my beachcomber shirt like literally every single day i'm gonna need it in more colors because it's become such a staple my meeting at school is in like half an hour so i'm trying to figure out if i have time to stop home or if i should just go right there we'll see Okay, so I just got home from my thing at school. It was really weird being on campus, but I'm actually low-key excited to start the year. I think it's gonna be a very exciting but busy one. I just made some lunch, which I'll show you guys. I actually got a few comments in my last few videos where I mentioned eating. People wanted to see my meals, so I'll start showing you guys that if you want. You guys are gonna think I eat the weirdest things, but this is kind of all that I had in my house at the moment. I made my favorite rice noodles, which I just buy at Whole Foods, and then I put red sauce, just regular red sauce on top, and then I mixed in some little green beans which some of you may think is so weird but I promise it's good I probably shouldn't be eating this on my white comforter but it's okay we love making bad decisions so good just finished eating my lunch I am now laying on the floor doing some editing work on my laptop I have been the biggest procrastinator lately on pretty much everything I keep putting off editing and summer schoolwork and all that stuff and it's a habit that I'm trying to kick before I go back to school because that's not how I want to start my new year so I told myself to dedicate like an hour to just getting a lot of this video done before I go to my next thing that's what I'm working on now I should also probably do some SAT work because I'm taking the SAT on Saturday yeah, my life is crazy. So I'm gonna work on this until I have to pack up my stuff to go to the dentist and then from there I'm going to Kira's house and we have our little night in Boston, which I'm so excited about But I have lots to do before then I'm about to leave. I just packed up all my stuff for the night. I brought a nice little outfit change in this backpack and then I haven't showed you guys this yet. Okay, so basically, if you are someone that follows fashion and trends and stuff, one of the biggest things of the summer was small little baby bags. I think this trend is so cute and there are so many brands coming out with so many different amazing bags. So when I was shopping in Boston for my school supplies, my mom and I stopped into this little boutique called Revolve, not like revolve.com. It's a secondhand consignment shop in my area and they have a store on Newbury Street. So my mom and I went in and I saw this bag and then I just could not stop thinking about it. So I went back to the store like a week later and got it and I am so obsessed with it. This is my new bag. It is a vintage Dior saddlebag. I am so obsessed with it and I got it one so much cheaper than it was originally and Dior just re-released these bags in like a different style and they sell for literally thousands of dollars which is crazy and I got this bag for not that. This is what the bag looks like on. It just fits right under my armpit which I think is such a cute look but also obviously I can hold it just like down so this is going to be my bag for the night but with a different different outfit. I can't even look at myself. No, it's okay everyone, so I just got to Kira's and <laughs> wow, I have a story time for you. So I already hate the dentist so much. Like I hate it, it's my least favorite thing. And I get to the dentist, so I'm sitting in my chair, the woman is digging, like scraping my teeth so hard, and all of a sudden my tooth pops out of my mouth. That's my current situation. Oh my god. It looks good. I start school on Monday. I have school pictures on Monday. And I have a busted tooth. <laughs> but it's okay. We're going to Seaport. We're going to Glossier. We're gonna have a good night. And we're just like really doing well right now. We 
Wait, this is so cute. So this is all the brow products. Ready? Yeah. You better not mess me up here. Else. What is it like so dark? <laughs> Okay, so like they have all these different shops at this pop-up and this one's literally just for like pics. This is so cute. I've always wanted to like go to this. Like you smell good. Like thanks. <laughs> like thanks so much. This is so cute. I'm obsessed. <laughs> I hate myself. I'm turning into you. <laughs> so these are all the shops. I love this. And then this is the big G. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this room has like this big Glossier G. I've seen so many people take pics here and we just took pics, I'm so excited. And they have this big mirror. I literally love this. And I've never been to Glossier before. So like the fact that it's in Boston pop up. I love this, we're having a night. We just finished up at Glossier. I have all my stuff in this bag that I'll show you when we get home. Definitely did not disappoint. I'm so excited we went and tonight is so pretty. I love Seaport. Hi everyone, so I just got home from Boston. Kira and I had such a fun night walking around the city. I love Seaport. I can't believe I've not been there more. That was only like my second time there and it was the first time I ever really walked around that part of the city. Now that I'm home, I wanna show you guys what I got from Glossier, but I did a bad job explaining what happened to my tooth earlier. Oh my god. Okay, so basically when I was younger, I was playing at a playground and I ran into a pole and I knocked these teeth out. So they put a bondage type of thing on top of it to make it look like an actual tooth. And today at my normal dentist appointment, she was like scraping and doing the normal stuff. It fell out. So that's why it looks like I'm missing a tooth. Like I didn't actually break a normal real tooth. That's what was confusing about my explanation earlier. A normal, regular, healthy tooth didn't actually break. It was just like the fake tooth, but still it looked Looks like I have busted teeth, but anyways, on a lighter note, I'll show you guys what I got from Glossier. This was the first time that I've ever been to a Glossier. I've never even ordered anything online, so I cannot wait to try out these products. I think the most exciting part about getting products from Glossier is the pink bubble wrappy thing that they put them in. I have wanted one of these for so long. I'm so excited to start using this. The first product that I got is the Invisible Shield Daily Sunscreen. I wanted to buy this at the beginning of summer, but it's been sold out on the Glossier website for a really long time. Like I think it's back in stock now, but but when I wanted to get it, it was sold out. So I got this today and the packaging is adorable. I'm really dumb. The name of this sunscreen is Invisible Shield, but I didn't realize that it's like a clear sunscreen. I think that's so cool. I'm gonna use this all the time. SPF is so important. And then the other things that I got are three of the bomb.com lip balms because if you buy three, then it's like a discounted price. So I got the rose one, the coconut one, and the birthday one. And I cannot wait to use all of them, especially the birthday one. My friend Katie has the birthday one and I used it the other day and it smells like vanilla and it's all shimmery. I'm obsessed. So those are all the things that I picked up tonight, but I am so tired now. We did so much walking around the city. I think I'm going to end this off here. I had so much fun vlogging today and I now have a busted tooth and some new Glossier products. So pff, we love that. If you enjoyed this, make sure to give it a thumbs up down below. Subscribe if you haven't or if you're new and I will see you very soon with a new video. Bye guys. Yeah.